Hello, everyone. Welcome to What the Sketch Wednesday. Hello, Mr. Herb. Hello, Mr. Steve. That's weird. It's not coming up on... Well, we'll get out of there. So, welcome, welcome. I'm going to switch my camera. And I may mute every so often, so there's that. I'm going to go to my overhead camera real quick. And I've had several people that are new that would that wanted to, to, to know what notebook I've been using. So I'm going to, this is the one I've been using. It's the the watercolor from Grumbacher or Grumbacher or whatever. I got this one at, at, at um, what's that called? At Walmart. I think it's like less than $10. And it's the 9 by 12. So I've been using this for, for a few few months now. And this is, um, let me go back up the other way. I've been just playing around with it, with sketching, doing my, my marker swatches. Hello, Miss Diane. A, a little better, but still, still on, on the coffee side. Co coughing side. There's the, the, the one I did for February, which was black and white. And I kept the page in between, so that way, if it bled, it, it, it will go into this page. But since when I finish, I could, I, because these pages, you're able to, to take them out and put them somewhere else in the notebook. That's why I like this. So once I, I finish, if I, don't, if I don't use this for anything else, I can move it to the back. And here's my March. Right, which I use color. Again, a, a blank page. And here's April. And the markers I've, I, I've used in, in the past, I've either used the, the uni pen pens, these guys right here. I have these linked in my Amazon store. So, in the, hey, YT Chris, hello, Karen. So in the, my Amazon store, you can find these in there. They come in a pack of six, I believe. But uh, I, these are, I need to get a new set because these are almost dry because I've used them a lot. And I can't put them back in here. Hold on. Hold on. <coughs> Excuse me. I need to, I need to help the, this little elastic. They're tight. <laughs> I got this on Amazon too. I also use these markers. I couldn't find them on Amazon, but I got these at Ross. So you can check on Ross and in those those discount stores in their craft section. And I, what I like I like about all, both these markers, they're waterproof. So if I use if I want to use um, alcohol markers, um, they won't bleed. And then the, for the color, I've been using the Prismacolor pencils. The, there we go. The Prismacolor Premier pencils. They're also um, linked in my description box below. If anybody's interested in those, and I use I use um, these Papermate pencils to sketch with. Come on. I don't want to, but. I like it because you could you can you know do that, and then I'm I'm also using nothing fancy for the eraser. Let me let me find the other one. They come in a two pack at um. Where'd it go? I was going to show you the 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 whole one because the, the one I have in my box fell apart. But it's a good it's a it's a good eraser. I'll show you. They look like this. The cap came off, and it comes in a two pack at, at um Dollar Tree. So that's what I use to, to erase all my 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 um my marks when I'm after I I sketch it. And then I also use sometimes if I need to highlight these jelly jelly roll pens. 
I think I have it have it linked below, but I'll I'll double check later. But this is like for the little highlights and stuff that I put all over the 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 the, the sketches. And these are blending stumps. They came with a kit kit that I bought. So um, but I'll I'll link these as well down below. This is good for um for the shading and stuff, blending the shading. So let's see who's who's walked in while I was talking. Hello, hello to Karen and Whitey Chris. Thought you might not go on tonight, but glad you did. It, it makes me happy to go on. <laughs> All day today, we're like, should I go on? Should I not go on? I mean, like, I look forward to these. And um, Mr. Miss Nati is here as well. Mr. Herb is saying hello to everybody. Thank you, Mr. Herb. Miss Kimberly Pajama Quilter is going to be go back to lurking. I could go for a jelly roll right now. <laughs> you and me both, Nati. And these are for my for for the lurkers, and that way I can cough while this is playing. <laughs> So if I if I mute, that's why. Cause I'm fine doing a day because I'm not Earl's working and I'm here working uh, and, and I'm not talking a lot, but when I start talking, so I may be quiet or I may mute. So this is what um I mean you seen the close go close up. I did all my sketch most of the sketches today because I like I said I wasn't up to any of that. There's there's my 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 bricks. I use like three three or four different colors in the bricks, and there's the the monarch. I decided to do just half of of a butterfly, and then I did a stapler, and then I did a rag doll, and I, I like the green from the stapler, so I, I brought the the color to the rag doll. And today's um, not today because I'm I'm going Tuesday Wednesday, so let me know if you guys want me to do Tuesday Wednesday and Thursday. I'm gonna I'm gonna start with with um Tuesday, which is a monkey. Hello, Miss Debbie. So you guys, let me know if you want to to do more 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 than two sketches today. It depends on how I'm feeling. Right now, we're going to do the monkey. And Wednesday, it's um, chocolate mousse. Oh, we're already talking about food. <laughs> Hola, Maritza. Hello, Miss Kelly. I bring it every day. So let me bring the, the little... What you guys all see is I, I, I bring up a, a little image on my screen that 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 I, I um get inspired by. So we're going to start. I'm gonna do this was gonna be more of a cartoony one. <clears throat> what was it again? You like that person pencil sharpener one? I like it too. It, it was one I did last last um Wednesday. We did the we did the, the wildflowers and then they're like oh let's let's do one more. So I did that one last Wednesday. It de it depends on the mood uh, how how they actually come out to me. So we're gonna do the the do the little monkey. Again, the, this oh I forgot to show the other thing I use. I cut this with my Cricut on cardstock, and then I I I put it onto the paper. And I trace all the squares. So that way I have the, a template for each one. And depending on the month, that's the, the square I start with. If anybody has any questions about what materials I use, let me know. And 
if I don't have it linked in my store down below, I I will add it later. And and I I'm just I just like to try different things. Like so, some of them are more realistic and some of them are not. Coffee time. Bring back me bring me back a cup. Did I drink all mine? Yes, I drank all mine already. Hi, Miss Angel. So I'm gonna need some coffee, Mr. Herb. Bring some coffee. I'm not gonna because of the, the way I have his face, I'm not the ears are gonna be on the outside of the body. So we're just gonna do his head. I'm I'm sure you could you can tell that it's a monkey without me doing his ears when I do the rest of him. And like I said, go out onto Google and see which which drawing that because I, I, all I do is like a, this one's monkey, right? I type in monkey drawing. Excuse me. And then I look at the pictures and say, oh, which one do I like better? This one or that one? And then I start I start um sketching. I save it, and then I go from there. I do it with the pencil first. Sometimes I do it with pencil. I, this guy did it with a pen yes, this morning, so I'm like, I just went. My cup is the whole pot. Need to make more. Well, you don't want to share your, your, your pot? That's not nice. Yeah, um, Herb says my cup is too small, and I have a big cup too. I have a, I think, um, I think it's a ten ounce. I can't tell. Yeah, right there. Oh, wait a minute, it's more than a ten ounce. I gotta take a picture. Hold on, I can't see. <laughs> Thank you, Miss Angel. I, I I'm I'm streaming there today as well. Um, it, it didn't do much on um Instagram yesterday. You know, people wise. Oh come on, there we go. No, it got blurry again. Come on. Here I am trying to find it. It's an 18 ounce coffee cup. And, and, and Herb says it's too small. Can you imagine that? So what I'm going to do, because I want to add a little bit of, of the ears, because he, he looks a little weird. When I go back with my pens, I'm going to make his... This is just a guide. So what I do is, is I, I'll shrink his head a little bit. So when I do the, the, the face here, so let's see this part here. I'll make it smaller. I think that was too small. Oh, well, we can figure it out. There we go. Well, not too bad. He needs his, his nostrils. It looks like a frog, doesn't it? So far. <laughs> oh, Angel says, Curious George. It looks like Curious George in the image I'm looking at. So see right here, this part here, gonna be smaller. Go like these. And I'm going to erase because it's the lines are, are messing with me right now. Hello, Mr. Barry. Hello, Mr. Snow Crusher, Greg. Did anybody else come in? If I if I didn't say hi, just say hi again. I'm looking down the sketching and they're looking at the 
See, the, this side over here got a, a little. So we're gonna have a some a, a little bit of character here on 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 this little monkey. We got. And we're gonna just do that. There we go. He's getting some character now. And I, I, I don't think I I I added to this um stream, but I will add the the doodle wash link is is the the, the prompts that I'm using to make these. And I've been using their prompts for the partly for um what's that called? February and all March and all April. This ear is gonna be off off the side over here, no big deal. I think he needs a little neck, right? Let's give him a neck. There we go. And those shoulders. Now we add some color. There's some pencil lines here still, so I'm. That's another reason I like using these the, these um pens. It's because I can erase and it doesn't smudge. Same thing with the sharpies. One second. He, he he looks a uh, but that's that's okay um Kara says i did a crochet monkey lobby eight years ago as a baby gift and it's still my fave and nati says reminds me of freddie the frog for the new zoo review tv show from the 70s oh i've never i've never seen that show i'll have to look at it and look it up so we're gonna get the brown and what's and then the the tan or what, what color is this Ooh, this way no this way i'm i'm let's see what color it says because i can't see come on there we go it is ginger root and this one is burnt ochre I'm going to mute because I need to, I need to sharpen this one. It's 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 all the the way to the end. Eyes back. So his face. Let's see. This part is supposed to be bigger on, on, on his ears, and I didn't do it bigger on his ears, but that's that's okay. We, we're going to play, work with what we have here. And then this part here. Okay. And this, this is your monkey. You, you can paint him any color you want. And sometimes... Um, Excuse me. I sometimes go with the, the the inspiration photo and sometimes I don't. This guy here, um, I just looked at a bunch of rag dolls and didn't like any of them. So he, I just, you know, ma made a shape and gave him a bunch of stitches and patches. Cuz that's what I thought a rag doll should look like. So it, it, it's not it's not all what you might call it um, from the inspiration photos.
I'm going to give him some color. I do one coat of the color and then, and then where I think he needs highlights or, or low lights or, you know, shades and shadows, then I come back and give him a, a little extra. Excuse me. I'm back. Miss Miss Angel, you're hired. She says, please, please hit the like button and follow Nancy on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram. Scan the QR code for great gifts. She's hired. Now, I, I, I'm for some details and stuff, I need to grab my glasses. So we, we want to give him a little bit of darkness under his neck. Because, you know, you got the shadow under your neck. Right around here. And then over by his shoulder here, add a little bit more color here and there. His ears are, are you know, a little bit further back from his face, so we right there on the edge. And then around the edge here. There we go. And you can keep on going until you... You like the way it looks. That poor monkey has a skinny neck. <laughs> Hi, Miss Liz. So do I, do I want to add a, a color to his... Because sometimes I add color to the background, but sometimes I don't. So it depends. See right here, I just did a, a, sh a shade. So this is this one also has like sh just shadows. So oh, do do I add a color behind him, or just do do some shades and shadows? About the same as yesterday, Miss Liz. Thank you for asking. But uh, the good thing is, is I'm not getting worse, right? So do we want to add a color to him? And now we're doing some shades and shadows. Should we add a, a background color to the monkey? No, I, I, that's not my hand. My hand's a lot smaller. <laughs> yellow background. Ooh, that's a cool color. Yellow. I don't. I don't think I've done a yellow background. Let's do this one. Love you. Love you too. You were on camera, you know that. Up here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I forgot to mute. Sorry, guys. And you can do the 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 background just around the 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 character or you can do like i've done here where it's just just a little bit it's right here is the whole background like here, here is the whole background so i'm thinking of, of just doing a little yellow around him i hope i didn't i didn't bust your ears with the sharpener i, I forgot to mute because the sharpener is right behind my computer So I do it real dark around the, the actual character and then I then I then I um feather it out or you know blend it out sort of. So I like to do it dark like that. Oh it, he's falling off the screen. Hold on. 
get back over here, monkey. And then I add a little bit to blend it out. There we go. I think he looks cute like that. Mr. Earl, well, left to go um, using my emoji. Using my Earl, e you got an Earl emoji? Oh, I need to do that. I need to get, take a picture of Earl. If you guys are members, I did change one of the emojis, the turtle emoji, into Kermini. I took a picture of that and made it into an emoji. So I need to make it, get an Earl emoji. I have to take a picture of Earl. Okay, the monkey's done. Woohoo! The next one is a chocolate mousse. There's Cremini. Excuse me. Let me get my picture. Um, where is it? Oh, this one. Oh, let's zoom in a little bit. There we go. Oh, I forgot to show you guys. Jay did, kept up. Uh, he was he was fighting me of trying to, to learn how to crochet. I could never do this. I could never do this. Look what he made me. His his second chain, but look, look, those are come on, pretty even stitches, aren't they? There's there's a couple that are that are that are a little big, but I sat him in front of me again because I, I tell him you know here's this and he goes okay I got it, then he leaves, I can't do it I can't do it. So um, I, I set him in front of me again, and we did it slowly, but surely we, we, we did it. And he was, like, so excited. He goes, Mommy, I did it. I did it. And then he made another one and gave it to his dad. He goes, I'm making, excuse me, I'm making, um, he, he said he was going to make a bracelet for everybody in the family. So he, he was excited. So we're gonna work on the chain for a few uh, for a few more days, and then we're gonna try the single crochet. I'm doing a little, a little cup. Pretty soon, now I'm gonna ha need him to 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 make my stuff so I can make other stuff. I, I want to make some some um, more notebooks, but I've been crocheting a bunch of um, flowers and um, impkins. It's like you you, you 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 do one thing and it's like, wait a minute, I want to do that too. I want to do that too. I want to do that too. So it's like. Oh no, I can't do it all. So I'm, 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 he's gonna he's gonna be my employee one day. <laughs> No, mom can have some. Well, actually, he's he, he he's using my yarn right now. I gave him one of my Red Hearts um, Super Saver yarns, and he 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 did what I asked him to do. He tried the Susan Bates hook first, and he was having trouble um, doing the bringing the the you know the chain through. And I told him, okay, um, I gave him my dots hook. 
and he did it with that. He goes, I like this one better. So I said, okay, you see, you, you have you just have to keep on trying until you find the, the hook that you like and the way and the way to hold it. He holds it a little bit different than I do. But he 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 was doing it, so I left him alone. So that that's what you need to do is it's like if if you if you're having good good success with that one that way do it that way because not one way is the right way it's whatever way you feel comfortable with same thing with sketches you, you do what you want one second Sorry. Here we go. Now we're going to add some details. Again. Because the cap um, is missing. It, it doesn't stop it from going back in. That's why I was looking for the other ones to show you. I don't know. I think it dropped it and it just fell off. Hello, Miss Chris K. There we go. Still there. Okay. Let me get my my colors. Oh, they're using. Hey, he's gonna match this guy. It's about the same colors. Did I put those colors away? No. Here, here's the other color. Here we go. Is that one? Ginger root. Yeah. So we're going to do layers of mousse. And I have this part up here as well, colored in. Hola, Miguel. Yes, I saw your email. And it's weird that some some people got their, their their little happy mail last week, and some people are getting it this week. So, the mailman is funny in doing that when they all went out the same day. So it could be weather or who knows what. I I, I when it comes to YouTube and mailmen and the mail, I I I, st I stopped trying to 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 decipher. How they, how they act, you know what I mean? Cause it, it's just crazy. It it needs to be a little darker brown. Let me go grab another color. Cause this looks too reddish. I want it more more brownish. There we go. It looks the same on screen, but. In real life, it, it's it's a little browner. Okay, we got we got give the cherry on top a little color. Where's my red? Here it is. My red is right there. Give the little cherry a color. There we go. And then we're going to do some shading for the rest of it. I think I'm going to do. I'm gonna go with, with 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 these colors over here, the, the greenish, for the straws, because I'm like for some reason I'm 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 in a green mood today. So we're just gonna color some of these stripes here on the in the straw, green. Cause why not? There we go. Okay. Hello, Miss Connie. Now we're going to do some shading. Went without thinking about food, and bam, she's sketching me hungry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I meant to. Bl blame um, Doodle Wash. They're the ones that told me to do to, to do um. Chocolate mousse. 
we're gonna do a little, little bit of color down here gonna do a little bit of color here and a little bit of color up here and then that's when you get the blending stomp and blend 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 get a little color here there there and the, the, the little moose guy up there and then I, I just like a halo look look angel I'm doing a halo around the, the, the cup a little halo you see the halo halo there we go there we go okay that's still a little blending bit more there and there and add it over there so there is our chocolate mousse see sometimes I add color sometimes I just do the shading and then we do what I like to add is I don't know I just I I just like adding that on the both sides and get, makes it pop out of the screen so do you guys want to continue with the third item the, the one for tomorrow is a scooter give me a thumbs up if you want to see the scooter of course uh so i'm going to do a intermission and i shall return shortly use the restroom and blow my nose I know too much information right uh, let's see Angel says of course she gives me a thumbs up Liz says sure YT Chris says yes Chris Glass will give me a thumbs up not to give me a thumbs up awesome guys okay we're gonna do a scooter now and this the the, the inspiration does not have a color for the scooter is just a, a, a sketch of the scooter so you while I'm sketching you guys tell me which which color I should paint the scooter excuse me okay I'm back And it's, more, it's, it's, it's like a Vespa sort of scooter. So it's going to be a small one because I have to do both both wheels, right? And, I, and I'm doing both wheels. It's going to be a short scooter right here. So this goes across like this. Across that way. So this goes like this. And goes back. And around, and it goes up here. Then we have this part here. It goes up like this. Well, it goes up, up a little bit higher. Uh, actually, it goes about the same height as this one. So we're going to bring it back down to the tire. And then this piece goes here here and there it goes up a little bit higher and the, the seat 
goes there. I think no, it doesn't go that far back. It goes right around there. Comes to here. He needs to be a little bit lower here. There we go. Now we're going to do the front part handles. Go up. Up. And go down this way like these. It's got a little headlight. And this is the handle. There we go. Now we bring out the pen and then the details. So this line goes all the way across this way. Then we got the tire and the tire and the hubcap. And this one goes like this there again the tire let me do this back part here this is the the fender part over here Now we go this way. The ones I did today, I didn't. I didn't record and did and do a short like I usually do, because I, I I just didn't want, want to deal with editing and all that fun stuff. But I will take pictures and put put them on on my. YouTube page, my community tab. There's the light. And then from there, we got the. And then they have a little line right there for, for the seat. That's a nice scooter. Thank you, Miss Liz. Now we. I didn't see any colors come in. What color do we want to cut? Paint this, I mean, color this scooter. I know that the tire is going to be black, so we're going to grab the Sharpie and do, do the, the black Sharpie for the tire. But he needs some color. There we go. Ta -da. See right here, it, it, it feels like it, it needs to continue using my small marker. Okay, and now we just the fenders. I think it needs to be a little bit darker because they're f further to the front of the scooter. You know what I mean? Like that. Oh, I know what to do with here. Ha. Hold on. Okay, um, Steve, go to your corner. Chartreuse, seriously? I did ask for a color. I'm sorry. And and Chris Kaleidoscope says says um, red, but I was going to do this. I'm going to make it into a nighttime sort of deal, but I'm going to, like right here, do yellow coming from the little headlight here. And then we'll do dark, dark behind them. A pink, okay, we got red chartreuse and pink. Got to go give chickens and goose fresh water for the night. No problem, Mr. St um, I was going to say Steve. Miguel, thank you for joining us.
You never have to apologize, Miss um, Darcia. Periwinkle says Carney. There's no, uh, uh, okay. We got pink, red, chartreuse, and periwinkle. Pick from 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 for those those four colors. I'm going to add a road behind it. Okay. So I'm gonna do where is it? I don't want it bit too dark, but but I'm gonna do a dark, dark, dark background so the light can show up. So you, it looks like it's lighting up this where he's driving. Chris Kalasco says dark red. So we got two reds. Was or were, were they both from hold on, who who was the other red? No, I saw a red. Oh. It was both um red. <laughs> Kimberly says coming out of coming out of the woods for periwinkle. I don't know if I have periwinkle. I'll have to look through my colors. So uh, around the, the scooter, I'm going to make it darker. This is a per, uh, this is a violet that I'm using now. So it, it it does have purple already. Just darken that area around it and blend it it has this texture on the paper so that's that's the texture you see this paper if you use the back side is smoother so if you wanted to have not have texture like this you, you, you would flip your paper to the other side but I, I don't I don't mind the texture on some things Okay, we got two reds. Okay, we got red. Put that back. Red. It's on the other. No? Did I not put it back? Red, where are you? Hold on. Seriously. Hold on. No, he's not back there. Red. I know I used red for this this guy right here. Oh, here it is. Duh. Okay, red it is. <laughs> so I'm going to make the fenders dark, 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 dark red. And then the rest of the, the scooter a little lighter with the same red. Because you can, you can press harder on, the, on these pencils and make them really dark. And then the rest of the scooter, we're going to go a little lighter. Like this. Okay. Okay. And we, get, we need a color for the seat. Let me see. Um, 
Let's see if I have periwinkle. I don't think I have periwinkle. Uh, no. No. What's that? Process red? I don't know what that means. Aqua. Violet. True blue. But well, even if you guys want with the periwinkle, I don't have a periwinkle. I'm going to have to get an, another set of, um, um, of pens. I mean, what is this thing called? I think I'm going to give him a pink seat. Right? Pink seat. Pink. And then this part up here will be pink too. I'm going to add some pink in the background just to add a little bit of pink. Why not? Okay. Now we're going to do some shading down here. Okay, let's put you back because I don't need you anymore. That's what happens when, when and I, I don't put things back. I, they, they, they decide to, to go on their own. So we're going to shade right here under the tire. And then I'm going to shade down here under the seat. I'm going to put a little shade under the tire. And blending stop. There we go. Stomp, stomp, stomp. Blend, blend, blend. Under the tire. Right here. Under the seat. There's the scooter. Okay, now we add the Sharpie. There we go. And you guys, I, I, let me show you guys what. There we go. I have my pencils right here, so I'm, I'm flipping back and forth. With my case here, so that way I can see all the colors. And then my, my drawing utensils, like the markers and pencils, are on this side and eraser. <laughs> Cremini. Okay, next week's sketch is what's next week? 17 plus 7 is 20. A barbecue. Do you guys like watching more than one sketch per Wednesday? I, I can do Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday like I did today, next week. So Tuesday would be a perfume bottle, then a barbecue, and then an osprey. If, if you're enjoying this, and, and please share me out. We want other friends to, to to check all the fun stuff that we're having here. And I'm, I'm putting my pens back, you see. Because you know, Nancy, then, then this here holds all my little sketchy pens and pencils and erasers. I, I like the inside. A friend of mine gave me this. It says, Crafty Girl. And then, hold on, let's, let's put this the way I have it on my screen. There we go. There's April so far. This is, where, where was this? The scooter, the 18th, which is tomorrow. Let's switch the camera. Where's my, there we go. Hi there. Thank you, Darcia.
periwinkle is a Crayola color. But it's not a Prisma color. <laughs> If they have something similar, um, it's a bigger pack. I don't, I don't have it. I don't, I don't have the big pack. I think I have a thirty-six. So far, this little guy, people are wanting to call him Earl Junior. I'm not sure. Hey, Mama Gwen. So, um, go to the 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 community post for him, and give him a name. But so far, three people have said yes to Earl Junior. I don't know about that. There we go. And th this one on Friday, whatever names are under her um, in the community posts, I'll be doing a poll on Friday, and we'll pick her name. So those are the guys. And then um, you guys saw my, my carnations that I made, the pink and the blue. I mean, I don't know what those colors are. The pink and the yellow. I don't know. He's the, oh, Mama Gwen. <gasps> I'm gonna tell. <laughs> and I made a purple one yes yesterday. And then I didn't have enough orange, but so I, I made a small one. So it's half the size of, of the other ones. And I tried a, a rose as well. So these will be up uh, available for the for sale at the Mother's Day boutique uh, next Friday, the twenty sixth. So share with your friends. Come and sh see what what else is available. I will I, I will be making some more flowers, and I have some notebooks and um, these two empkins will be for sale as well. So there's gonna be a lot of things for sale. And thank you guys for joining me today. What yarn did I did I I use? Uh, I love this cotton from Hobby Lobby. When it when it all these all the impkins are I love I love this cotton. The flowers are I love this cotton. The the daisy back there is I love this cotton. That's my favorite favorite yarn so far. I haven't tried anything else that um for amigurumis, so that's what I use. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Again, I'll leave the 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 link to Doodle Wash in the description box below after the live. I think I've been forgetting to do that, but I'm so sorry. Until next time, be brave, be strong, and create. Where is it? A monkey, chocolate mousse, and a scooter. I'll see you guys on Friday. We're going to do a um, quilted ornament that looks like a parasol or an umbrella. You know, April showers. Hello, Miss Adele. So until next time, bye-bye. Here we go. I already did the, the, the tagline, so... <laughs>